Mariah check this out. We are moving our six by eight foot chicken coop to our house down the street. We moved it up here so far. I wanted to let you know, depending on the size of your coop, you might be able to use it your, move it yourself without disassembling. Ours is built in such a way that you cannot disassemble it very easily without destroying some of the structural integrity. Well, you'll see where our chickens are at is right where that thing used to be. And I don't know if you can tell or not, but this is a hill it comes up here. And I wanted to salvage that post rather than digging and pouring for a new post. I cut it at a height where I could add some, some Simpson strong tie, like some straps and uh, nail those in, still make it usable. Pulled off all the fence boards and something else we've been using that's really helpful uh, because my wife does not have quite the same strength that I do. Um, <laughs> I, I built this, I framed this out so I can actually stand in there and lift it up uh, like a trap bar for deadlifting if you've ever been in a gym. And on the front side, we just found an old hand truck. We wedged this sucker under here. It's hard to do with the phone. Get up underneath it and it allows just enough clearance and the wheels to get under there while I get up on the other side and we literally just move it along um, and then to get down the street I just removed a section of fence that is wide enough for that coop and then we're going to put it on a flat cart like a dolly we're going to put it out in the middle of the road but we just have to go towards the end of the street which isn't too bad and there we go, we move it into our new backyard. And there you have it. Sometimes folks just takes a little ingenuity, some thinking, being creative, and you can make things happen without spending a bunch of money. Thanks for watching.